Hello everybody. <coughs> Sorry about that. <coughs> Georgia Burns here. Today I'd like to show you how I made this pretty card. To make this card I used the stamp set Art in Bloom, which is in the new catalogue. And I'm using all the flowers and all the leaves. The background, believe it or not, is a stencil. I was sorting out upstairs. I've got a load of craft stuff upstairs. And I come across this. And I knew I hadn't used it. So I thought, oh, I'd give it a go. So if you do make this card, you can use any stencil you want. Um, the flowers I have already cut out somewhere. Oh, yeah, yeah. And the leaves. But I will do another set apart from cutting them out. The sentiment comes from the many messages dies. Now I've got a spare one here. It says, so happy to hear your exciting news. Congratulations. Which could be anything. And I've also cut out a stitch square that goes underneath there. Um, from the stitch squares set. And this is the second largest. Cards I have got a card base of eight and a quarter by five and seven eighths. And that has got a piece sticking out of it. Eight and a quarter by five and seven eighths, scored at four and one eight, folded in half and burnished. I have got two pieces of white at five and five eighths by three and seven eighths. This is basic white, one for the top and one for the inside. I don't think I did anything inside, no. One for the inside. And I've got some scraps for the flowers and leaves. Right, so first off, we're going to stamp our flowers and leaves. The flowers actually come in one big stamp set. So, cut that, stamp that up, sorry, in memento black ink and stamp it down. Like that. And pop that on my cloth. Right, and I've got the leaves. So I've got the big one, and I want three big leaves. And then I want three of the double leaves. Let's see if I can get three on here. Like that. Right, so now we need to add some colour. I've got so soft succulent. And we're going to colour all the leaves in this. So we use the double um, filler stamp and just fill them in. And I've got the big leaf filler and we just fill that in. Like that. Right on this one, I did the cards in yellow, uh, the flowers in yellow, but this time I'm going to do them in blushing bright. So I have got 
Now you have to bear with me because I can't remember which one's which. That one's there. A very subtle it's the colouring. And then I've got this one obviously for that. Leaf there. Like that. And then the last one. I call this the squished one. And that is all our stamping done. Then you cut these out. The magic of TV. Look. Or video recording, should I say, not TV. I've cut them all out. They will go for another card. Right. Now we've got to do the background. So what I'm going to do is find my... Um, tape and I've got a bit of tape here that I'm going to curl around let me just not so sticky put on the sleeve of me top and I'm going to pop that in the middle there just to make this a so it was secure now these do not go over it like that so what I'm going to do is do it this way This one first, and I'm going to bring it down so it's like the middle, and we're going to put a bit of tape on. And what I really should do just to keep my surface clean, so I've got another card to video yet after this one. Right, I'm going to stick that there. And stick this one there. Then what I've got is a brush and my balmy blue and we're gonna just cover this in balmy blue Right, that's the first layer done. Now we're going to add this one. And we're going to darken the rest up. I think if I'd used a doorbell or a sponge, 
this might have been a quicker process but because I'm using the brush it takes a little while to layer up the ink but that's alright, I don't mind I think that will do. And take this, loosen this off, and turn it round and put it back in the same place. But line it up with that. And repeat. Now you will be left with a line across the middle, and that is why we've got the um, stitch square because that will disguise the um, line. This one back on. And darken it up again. Just keep going over till you get it roughly the same colour as the other half you did. Now we have our pattern. Done. I think that looks quite nice. Right, get rid of this. Right. Like this. Then we'll have to go in the wash afterwards. And we'll bring this back. Now this line will be disguised by our diamond and you'll hardly see it. So before we start building up our flowers we will put this on here, glue, oh take this off, don't need this no more. quite a nice background apart from there where I went a little bit mad with the brush I've got my diamond in and I'm going to place my flowers and leaves on here before I um, 
stick it down on the card like that. So they're all just going to get glued down and I'm just gluing the bottom so that I can still get the leaves underneath. And then with the leaves, what I did, I put a big one. Again, I just did the bottom and dropped it under there. Then I got a double one, shoved that under there. Then I got another big one. I put that under there. Then I got a double one. I think you get it here that I did. Right, I need to cut that down a little bit. Just so we can get them under the flower. And then another big one. under there and the last double one yeah and then that will sit like that one needs to go under a bit more that's it We're going to put this on with dimensionals. So let's put a lid on my glue. Get my dimensionals out. Right, and some small ones to go on each of the leaves. I think I would have got big ones on there, but never mind. all these backings and come back in 10 minutes if you want I thought I wonder if you could hear my tumble dryer hopefully sorry if you can washing day today right that way and we will place our card down like that I think that looks rather nice and our sentiment We'll go here and all I'm going to do is put a dimensional just on the end of this one and I can't remember if I put a big one, I did. And then I glue 
the rest of it. And then we have to put some pearls on it. And I've got some an empty packet there. These ones I want. And I think these ones are attached. Yeah. So right, we only want three. We're gonna put one there, one there, and one here. a bit close in it. Oh. No, I can't take it off. Have to do. Right. That is our card done. Just got the inside to put in. Not stamped anything on the inside because I don't know what you're congratulating people for. You can write it on the inside. Oh, must have had a spare bit out. Right. There is our card done. Hope you like it. If you do, give us a thumbs up. And give us a, a like, a comment, a share and subscribe and if you do subscribe press the bell icon so that you'll be notified of any more videos I upload which is usually on Monday, Wednesday and Friday. All I can say is thanks for visiting and I hope to see you again soon.